Uh, we're here with Mike. He's about to unbox our uh, first Surface Go. All right. Very exciting moment. Right, we get to unbox a new piece of technology. <laughs> Now, what's different about the uh, Surface Go, Mike, than the uh, um, Surface Pro? It comes with a little less specs, but uh, I think four gigs, and, and then there's an eight gig version. But you get uh, it's only ten inches, and from what I just felt right out of the box, it's pretty light. It's really light. Uh, I guess it's to compete more with an iPad, but still function as a computer. So. Yeah, look at that thing. It is really light. That's nice. So, so it really just looks like a mini Same uh, Surface game. Pro. Yeah, mini little Surface Pro. Same buttons, it looks like. Uh, looks like all the same connections are there, except it's a USB-C. So, oh, yeah, that's new. So no USB-A connection. Uh, it looks like it. There is a spot for a keyboard. Um, our keyboard hasn't got here yet, but um, that's what comes right out of the box, and it looks like we got maybe a smaller charger, too. So, yep, a little mini charger. Cute. There it is, a little mini wall charger. And then uh, probably just a packet of information there. Yeah. All right, that is a new Surface Go. Cute little thing. <laughs> Standard. Uh, no, Intel. it's an uh, Intel like Pan oh, little yeah. gold processor, I think. But it runs Windows 10 Pro, so. Do they make a little keyboard for it? Um, yeah, yeah, there's a keyboard for it, but. It's on back order right now, so, but, so, yeah, 10 inches. Yeah, I'm going to do a test on this, so I want to see if it'll run that one piece of software. I've got, I've got my photo booth at home, and that actually might be a good replacement for the one that I'm using. It's really light, too. Yeah, especially, especially at the price point. I mean, the, I mean the, yeah, it's like 3 dollars 3 I think, for the, well, the uh, base model is 400 bucks. Yeah, for the, uh. Other version. It comes with Windows 10. That would totally replace your little high year setup in there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the screen, it's it's roughly the same size. I think it's an 11 inch, 11 inch that I have in that box mm -hmm. right now. So it's pretty sweet. 10 inch. Oh, look at this little guy. It's so cute. I like this thing. Yeah, the kickstands. Uh, I like the kickstand. A little charger. Mm -hmm. This would be perfect for like a little kiosk or like a. Um, one of those mock registers mm -hmm. places. Mm -hmm. So like if a place has a lot of uh, POS systems, like, you know, uh, uh, oh, yeah, Arabella's yeah. and Bistro and all that other stuff, mm -hmm. set that up with one of those little around, card yeah. swipers right there. Yeah. Bluetooth uh, receipt printer. Mm -hmm. You're ready to go. And, and this, this one, this one really runs light. full Windows 10 Pro, so. Windows 10 Pro. Mm -hmm. So we can enroll it into, mm -hmm. let it do all of its cool stuff. Camera on the back and the front too, so you can still do video conferences. Mm -hmm. This thing's nice. Here's the surface go. Awesome. So that's what it looks like. Now, does this also have a keyboard as well? It does have a keyboard, but we didn't like get cover it yet. Some so. of that. Yeah, it's still coming. So nice. <laughs> but just to check out. The and it has. Inch. So it's very similar, but just smaller than. Yep. No, it, it runs Windows 10 Pro, just a little smaller. The version you can buy in the Microsoft Store is only going to have Windows 10 S on it, I think. So it's a home version. You won't have a Pro version if you buy it from the store. Interesting. If you buy it, you got to buy it through a partner. Great. If you buy it through a Microsoft partner, you can get the full shebang on it. Yep. Great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They can still upgrade for the 99 bucks. You can still do the upgrade. You can buy it at the store, but you're still going to spend the hundred dollar difference. You know. So you might as well buy it. So with Autopilot and Intune, just sign in. Everything downloads that they need, and That's they're right. ready to go. That's right, yep. Yeah, we're about to do that right now, too. Sweet. So. Is that your old Surface there? Yeah, it's my Pro. That's a lot smaller. Yeah. Really, really closer to the camera. It looks like the, uh, the iPhone 8 Plus, you know? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> not, not too far off from there. Well, I mean, for 500 bucks, you can't really beat that. Mm -mm. That's pretty rad. 
functions as a right. you know, computer. Is that the only size that it comes in to go? Yeah, yeah. I mean, there's I mean, two models. The there's two models. You get it. Yeah, the screen size is a 10 inch. That's it. That's okay. uh But it comes in a 4 <coughs> gig, 64 gig model, or 8 gig. It doesn't have oh, 128 gig. gig. How much is the 8 gig one? It's about it's about 100 200 bucks more. Okay. So somewhere in that range. We're excited about the Surface Go for a lot of reasons. Uh, the primary one being that we're in love with the Surface line from the book to the Pro, the laptop, the studio. Uh, there's almost a completely full line of computers there except for what the Go now fills, which is sort of a netbook entry-level solution uh, for someone that still needs to run a full version of Windows 10 but wants a really tiny computer that's inexpensive. And we think the Go really fills that. Uh, slot in their lineup and uh, we're excited to uh, start getting those out to customers. We provide the entire Surface line as a service and you can check out a link below uh, to see how combining Microsoft 365 and the Surface is a complete IT solution and uh, as much IT support as most companies need for their workstations. So I uh, really recommend checking that out and if you're interested in a Surface Go, give us a call.